Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of WhatsApp with Ashwin. Now we're going to talk about the movie Chandu Champion. Karthik Aryan, directed by Kabir Khan. So, this is a real life story, meaning Mudli Khan Fedkar, a army officer, Paralympic champion, boxing champion, Asian Games selector, Almost tragic tale, but the tragic tale is an inspirational tale of how he is through all the adversity in his life. And that's what he does to showcase Chandu Champion. So, I don't know what to do, but after the COVID, the Bollywood box office is going to struggle. He doesn't have any interest in this film, he doesn't have any interest in this film. The audience members went up to standards after two years of OTT. So, after that, Bool Bulaya 2, he revived the box office in Bollywood in the box office. And he kick-started, I mean, on the year of the highest grossing movie, before Patan and Jawan and everything came. So, Kathika Aryan, he got a box office success. He got a two films, such as Satya Prem Ki Katha and Freddy and Shezara, just didn't work. Audiences didn't resonate with it. So, he got a career revived and he got a Chandu Champion. And it definitely lived up to the hype from the promotions that we saw. So, for this case, Karthik Aryan lost 90 kilograms and 77 kgs of weight lose. 30%, 39% of body fat and 7% to attain the body of a boxer. And usually, in the transformation, we don't know if we can tell the story about it. We can say, okay, it's a great story, it's inspirational, we can promote it. But, we can use it in the case of 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 the case. Swimming phase, the athletic physique was necessary and it was definitely showcased well by the director Kabir Khan. So, Kabir Khan is 83, Bajrangi Bhaijan, and he has a hit movie in Bollywood. So, he in the period drama engaged and untold story revived. I mean, hats off to him and his efforts. So, a few things I have to share in the film. First, on the boxing sequences. So usually, I don't know, like especially Indian movies that have boxing or fighting in it. Remember, technically, when we know boxing, we know that there is a punch or a sweat stains that we fly out of the way. Remember, we try to 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 try because it is easy like, okay, Karthik Aryan can get the comic and get the slow motion. But if we do it, 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 if we do it. So I definitely enjoy the boxing sequences. And song-wise, there's a song sang by Arjit Singh in a train sequence. They go to the newly selected recruits on the base camp. And the entire choreography was done in the bunker. So, in the room, there is no size of a bunker. There is a choreography, a song, a dance, and how it is. It is very realistic and very complex. It was showcased in the video. It was superb and I definitely love that song sequence done. You know, usually in the horror movies, we can see it. Like, when we finish the film, based on a true story, we can increase the fear of it. Why can't this be a true story? So, that is the horror sector. But in the part of Umiyave, for me to know that it was a real life story, I was shocked. You know, like, in words, I couldn't do it. That was the difficulty he faced in his life. First, he was doing wrestling. Then, he was doing the army. He was doing boxing. He was doing high level in the army. He was doing high level in the army. He was doing Asian games. He was doing Kashmir in Kashmir. He was doing ways down paralyzed. He was doing Olympic. He was doing swimming pickup, which is a completely different sport. At the highest level, the Paralympics, the goal was set for world record timing at the time. So, there is also a sequence that comes to the sequence. Literally, all the audience members stood up and the Jekra sequence. And it really resonated with everyone. Because everyone, you know, is very frustrated in the workplace, in the personal life. But we have our dreams, our focus, and we have to go to the end of the day. We have to go to the end of the day. Mudli Khan Fate Karoda Kada is definitely will resonate with our current audience. And especially a big credit has to be given to the art director and the 
the entire art team of this movie, including clothes and sets. Yena, it was a period film, current day, meaning almost or 70 years on the span, I mean, 65 to 70 years on the span, in the movie. Le. For example, our, our village in the 1950s, just post-independence India, British rule, the education, the schooling system, houses. So, that's a lot So, overall, I'll rate this movie a good 8.7 out of 10. Kandipa poi, you know, theater la paarenga. Yena, inna mari padala encourage panna da konjo standards u increase aagon. Like just in comparison to the big hero films, matra na work out na, you know, the quality of cinema will go down. So this is definitely worth a watch because the script and the character was the true winner, and everyone just played their parts very well. And it was definitely a great watch and an enjoyable movie for this weekend. So thank you so much for watching another episode of WhatsApp with Ashwin. I'll talk to you again soon. Thank you. <laughs>